It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a Latvian beer called Suzu Premium Amber. I'm presuming it's a lager. Quite like the design of this bottle. It's got a small, you could imagine this being a stumpy, a small French stumpy bottle. Uh, it's kind of stumpy on the neck, but then as you, as you move it up, quite a large thin bottle uh, it's a pint bottle as it clearly says there and it's got some pictures on the bottle of some hops and some grain some malt there so I'm looking forward to this one there's the bottle cap a crown on there a crown king's crown or a queen's crown and it fits really well in the hand sometimes when you've got smaller fatter bottles you you struggle to get your hands around it but you can get a really good grip on that not that any of this matters the main thing is the beer the beer was kindly sent to us by our channel sponsors beers of europe docker the uk britain's largest online beer store they've got some fantastic beers from america latvia just drunk a Ukrainian beer, they've got some Italian beer, German, Belgium, you kind of name it, if you want something pretty decent you're going to get it from beersofeurope.co.uk, go and check them out. Here we are, so it was described as an amber, for me that looks, I suppose up, up in the camera kind of looks amber it does look amber as a matter of a fact but I was just expecting it to be a little darker uh, loads of raging carbonation from the bottom of the glass it's a two to three finger white head it's a clear beer no clarity issues with the beer and yeah that carbonation is racing away up the glass let's get the aroma Not slightly spicy. This beer's definitely been brewed with malt. I just reviewed another beer, as I said, from Ukraine, and that was full of corn. It was a corn, but overly sweet beer, but this, this smells a lot better than that. You can actually smell the malt in there and a little bit of hot presence. So let's dive in, see what we get. Cheers. Actually, that's, a, that's not bad at all. Not bad at all. ABV on this beer didn't didn't give it to you guys. I imagine. Well, 5.2% ABV. There you go. This one has got a little bit of sweetness to it up front. And then it just kind of fades into that same old lager bracket, if you like. It's just a fizzy amber lager. It's got a, a strange, bitter kind of tangy finish it's a little bit sweet a little bit malty but it's still uh, I reckon there's corn in here uh, yeah another so called premium lager they all when I say they all let me explain a lot of these big lager companies they produce beers like this fizzy yellow amber colored beers and they always insist on using the word premium 
but there's nothing premium about these beers at all not at all if your idea of a premium beer is fizzy yellow water with a, with a slight tangy bitter finish then then don't even bother exploring the world of craft beer it's it's just not for me it's just not good it's, I, I can't believe that it's 2014 and before the craft beer revolution really hit, it's been hit in the last three years. Since the 1980s, 1990s, this beer was so popular. Everybody drank these fizzy yellow beers. Um, but now people, a lot of people are opening their eyes to really good beer. And uh, I, I, can't, I just cannot see a future for, for this type of beer anymore. I really can't. I, I struggle to even imagine it being around in 10-15 years time and if it is it'll be in very small quantities you will not be seeing the, the, the 24 packs for 15 pounds in the supermarkets anymore that probably won't exist um, saying that there's a market for cheap beer there is a market for it because not everybody can afford premium craft beer so uh, maybe maybe it still will be around but I won't I won't be drinking it I'd rather drink a glass of orange juice than than drink a pint of this fizzy yellow water to be honest I'd rather not bother drinking at all I'd rather not spend it I'd rather not spend my money on it if I'm honest um, it's simply not worth it um, even if it is cheap dire absolutely dire there's nothing premium but premium about that at all um rating then for suzu premium amber beer one point bottle from latvia two out of ten two out of ten from real craft beer put your comments in the comments box please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers